This video is about uh, the demonstration of how to size and also how to move a pie chart in Tableau. Uh, to, uh, to size the pie chart in desirable size, not too small, and also uh, move the pie chart into the desirable spot into the, the, onto the Tableau view. Uh, to do that, I need a data set. And I'm looking into, I search, I got this GitHub site. So before I decide to download files on the GitHub site, I always wanted to, uh, to check it out. Uh, what is the license term for this? So therefore, I move down to and looking for the license file. So open the license file and to read the license and understand this particular, uh, the GitHub repository is under MIT license, which is the open source, uh, open source license. So now I'm ready to download files. So go to this, this root folder of the GitHub site and the file I want to download is in the chapter three and I want to download these two files. One is hospital visits and the other one is hospital goals. Okay, right, and I already download these two files onto my local hard drive, so ready to hop into the Tableau desktop. Okay, in the Tableau desktop, I click in files, clicking new and just creates a blank Tableau workbook. And now once the workbook has been created, I just simply connect into the data since those both are CSV files, so both are text files. So select the text file and then choose the hospital visit.csv. Now I have a hospital visit.csv and then clicking add and clicking text file and then clicking the hospital goals.csv. So both I have connected to hospital goals and hospital visits. And then you notice hospital visits is already inside the data source canvas. I need to add a go into it too. So I just simply clicking on the hospital go, double clicking on the hospital go. So Tableau automatically place the hospital go into the canvas too, and then join these two tables together, combining both relevant records, related records together. So I'm ready to create a the worksheet. So clicking on the worksheet. So this time I want a uh, I want a I want a I want a pie chart, right? So first I want to put the department branch into the row sh row shelf, and I want to put the revenue onto the column shelf. So by default I'm getting a what I'm getting a bar chart, right? But I want a pie chart, so. I just click in show me and select the pie chart. So now I have a pie chart, right? I have a pie chart. And some other things I want is I want to show some text, right? I want to show some text. So that means I need to uh, move all the, the, the branch and the revenue into the, 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 the label card, right? Into the label card here, the mark card, okay? Right? So the way to do that is is not just move, right? You just basically copy it, okay? Uh, in the Mac, you need to hold and press hold down hold and press down the command key. In the Windows, on the Windows, you need to hold and press down press and hold down the control key, right? So press and hold on the command key and drag the drag the hospital branch, right? And from color card into the the label, right? So now I have a label shows, okay? Right? Same thing, I need to hold, press and hold down the control key or command key based upon what is the operating system is. So press and hold on the, the command key, right? And then drag the revenue also onto the label. So now you have both, right? You have the, the hospital branch as well as the dollar amount, the revenue. But this is a little bit too small, okay, right? It's a little bit small, but additionally, I also want to add a percentage, also adding into the label, right? And to label for the revenue. So there's a trick, there's a trick. So, and to do that, you cannot simply copy or move to the label, right? So the other way to do that is hold on the command key or control key and copy the sum revenue into the detail. So the, then you have a detail, additional detail, okay? Right, additional detail. So this detail, and I want to 
make it a percentage of the total, which is a table calculation, right? So clicking the down chevron key, and quick table calculations, and percent of the total, okay, right? So therefore, uh, this is a table calculation, the percent of total. So now I can move this guy, right, into the label as well. So now I have, not only I have the revenue, the dollar amount, I also have a percentage, right, percentage right, for each hospital branch. So now basically you have just created a uh, created a pie chart, right, with the desirable labels, okay, right, desirable labels. So now let me just simply close off this menu, okay, right, and close off this menu. So now we need to do two things. One is to uh, the size, make it bigger, and two is uh, to see if we can move a little bit towards the center, right, towards the center. So how to do that? The first thing is, we can move, uh, we can resize it, okay, right? So therefore, you you clicking the size and clicking the, the move size a little bit, right? And then you notice the size are getting bigger, okay, right? Getting bigger, right? And this will be a too big, okay? So now, once it's getting too big, right? You have this, like the, you know, the, some kind of, the, the circle has been cut off, right? So you move your mouse, uh, move your mouse, right? And towards, uh, towards this, uh, the horizontal line and you notice the shape of your cursor changes so now you can actually drag right you can see you can drag okay right so it is it is you actually have to try until you see the change of the cursor shape right your cursor shape is like the arrow so once you your cursor shape becomes a double arrow so now is you can clicking uh, drag the uh, clicking down the mouse and drag down okay right so this is how you do it and then additionally, this vertical line, you can do the same. Now you can drag this thing a little bit over, right? The way you drag, so therefore keep dragging, okay, right? All right, so now I can keep dragging here too, right? Okay, so now keep dragging there, right? And keep dragging a little bit here. Right, you notice your ball, right? Your beach ball has been dragged into nearly the center of the view, right? Center of the view. So now this is too big, right? So now I can click the size and clicking make it smaller. So now this looks like it's a desirable size, right? Of the the pie chart, right? So it is kind. This is the way I figured out. The, the, you know, the I there's a uh, I spent quite a bit of the time trying to figure this out. Is there any easy way? I had so far I have not found out so this looks like the to me it's like an undocumented way and to uh, to number one to size the the pie chart the beach ball number two is to move the beach ball to a little more desirable spot onto uh, the, the the tableau ta uh, tableau view okay so that concludes the demonstrations